today, once again on set, we have our wonderful empowerment correspondent, Shantae Jones. Welcome, Shantae. How are you? Thank you, Donna. I'm amazing. Anytime I get to come and be on set and share with the audience, I'm having a great time and I'm excited. We have a beautiful guest here today. Who did you bring? A powerhouse, <laughs> a visionary, wow. an agent of change. I introduce to you Jean Price. Wow, thank you. Thank you for having me on no, the show today. No, you're welcome. Thank you so much. So we got a chance to meet um, at an entrepreneurship conference. Mm -hmm. Yes, we did. And you really truly are a visionary. You're making right? things happen. Right. How did this journey begin for you? How did this calling happen for you? Can I tell you, it's all, it all started with my story. Okay. And my story is, as a child, I was abused. And I could remember that I rem in my heart and my passion, I always wanted to get back to women, to help them get back on their feet. And it has been my goal, my desire, and I have seen this for, be fulfilled, and I'm mm -hmm. excited about it. I really am. I am. That's great. So can you share with our audience some of the things you do as far as programs or partnerships to really spur women in regards to their purpose? Yes. One of the things I'm doing right now is a six-month fellowship program, mm -hmm. and it's geared to empowerment and geared toward the growth of women from the internal so that the external can represent what's going on on mm -hmm. the inside. Because I found that many times in my life that I was so broken. Right. And when I had the opportunity by my faith to grow and be developed and to change, I saw something in that. Mm -hmm. So as I began to mentor girls and women, I began That's to right. see their lives change. And that mm -hmm. sparked me to just keep going and going. And another organization I started is called Beginning Anew, mm -hmm. Community Development Corporation community-based resources. Mm -hmm. How does somebody take their life from where they are and start all over again? Yes. It yes. has to come from somebody that's been there. Mm -hmm. And then you take those tools that each person that you begin to mentor, you see their lives begin to transform. That's something money cannot buy. No, so not true. at all. No. That's there amazing. was a moment in my journey, I had a dollar ninety-seven in the bank. Mm. And I can share that now because I have a, I'm okay. Yes. But there was a time where I went to the bank, I put uh -huh. my ATM card yes. and I was like, uh-huh. Oh, but I didn't close my account because I had faith. Yes. And I also had, and I also knew that yes. no matter what, you can always, every day is a new beginning. Yes. And you get support from each other mm -hmm. and you figure it out, you figure out a way. I've also become very resourceful because of that. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, and instead of being wasteful, you know, and then mm -hmm. through that, you get an abundance and yes. then you can share. That's so really obviously, you've had to go through a lot of challenges personally in your life mm -hmm. so that you could actually be there for I someone have. else. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have. And when I've seen women come back, Donna, and just a glimpse, and I'm one thing, let me just say this, I always understand it's not about men. Okay. Mm. I don't want any glory. Mm -hmm. I just always want to be humble. But to see somebody come back and say thank you, yes. mm -hmm. that to me is enough. And guess what? It motivates me to do it again. And then I always tell somebody, if God did that for you, you do it for somebody else. Because that's where it makes that's a difference yes. when you do that. And the saying that I always say is the best that we will ever be it's what we allow each other to become. Mm -hmm. If you will allow me to be the woman that I am today, I believe if I allow you, you know what? We can really be partners in this thing. Oh, yeah. That's amazing. You just amazing. gave me chills. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I, just, I got chills wow. just because wow. I feel exactly what your energy yes. is and your authenticity. Wow. And I know how many people mm -hmm. you're helping. Yes, you're on a mission. You I am. Yes. I really am. And I can't stop. <laughs> and I won't come down. I won't Good. Come down. <laughs> and that's what feeds you and propels you to keep going. Because I know every day isn't a rainbow and sunshine yes, day. Right. But because you have the internal purpose mm -hmm. and you're driven to make sure that your life's work leave a legacy, you keep going. Mm -hmm. And I see it. I feel it. That's why I'm so glad you're here and you're talking Thank to you. Donna. Thank but I do want to ask in regards to entrepreneurship because we have a lot of entrepreneurs mm -hmm. now budding entrepreneurs how does faith play a factor in business well for me faith pay, plays a factor because I think like you said I love your testimony with the dollar 97 when you don't have anything else you have to lean on your faith mm. and with your faith for me it just caused me not to not stop to just keep going no matter what with that dollar 97 if that was my story like Donna like okay this is all I have right. but if somebody needed that dollar 97 mm. I would give it to them, them. that's yes. it yes. that's what I'm yes. saying I would have gave them that too right. because guess what <laughs> my faith would have let me know oh there's something else is getting ready to come absolutely and every single time yes God came through 
every time. So faith for me is a major factor in it. That's, I love that's that. That's my stepping stones to know. Mm -hmm. You know, you go from faith to faith. So that's yes. kind of a stepping stone. You know, Amazing. even even a funny little story. Even growing up, like you know, whatever like the last piece of something was, like mm -hmm. the last piece of candy mm -hmm. or whatever, right. I'd hoard it in our refrigerator <laughs> in the butter tray. Right? Really? Like, oh no, that's mine. You right, can't touch right. it or whatever. You know, right. like my brother Michael would be like, oh no, 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 no. I, I took the last cookie, the chocolate chip cookie, and it's in the butter dish. Don't touch anything in the butter dish. Right? <laughs> so. You learn, though, yeah. generosity, yeah. you know, it's a thing that could be mm -hmm. really um, important in your mm -hmm. life, right? So now I still, to this day, you know, uh, he's one of my favorite people, my brother Michael, and, and I'll be like, oh, is it in the butter dish? And you mm -hmm. learn how to share because mm -hmm. my grandparents mm -hmm. also taught us about sharing. Yeah, She'd right. always, like, they sold candy for a living, um, and they'd be like, okay, we're going to give you candy, Donna, but you you know about sharing, right? right? right. Like, yeah, I know about sharing. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I'll make sure that that happens. Wow. But I think those skills that you're teaching those young yeah. uh, people in, mm -hmm. in their journey mm -hmm. about all of those, just those mm -hmm. basics of life that what's yes. going to make it yes. sustainable, yes. you know, is so, yes. it's yes. so yes. wonderful that yes. you're doing that. Thank you. Thank yeah. You. And I have to tell you, sometimes it's not just the younger generation. You'd mm -hmm. be surprised how many women at my age or even older that have opened up to me about different struggles they've had, just even knowing them. Because, you know, p what I'm learning is that people really want to be free from the inside. Yes. People know, I was once depressed. I understand it. Mm -hmm. I once was in the total mindset of despair. I got that too. People don't want to always live like that. They really want to know that I'm not just existing. But mm -hmm. I'm really living. Yes. And that does make, it makes a difference. It does. So I can wake up every morning grateful for God. He allowed me to see another day but on purpose and intentional about going out there to be a blessing for someone else. And you're actually taking oh, this on the road. You're going places yes. with this. <laughs> Donna, Let's listen, talk about that too. Listen. Where are you going? My <laughs> goal is this. My goal is to take the fellowship program to another state, just mm. getting some women together. We meet once a month. We go in there and we empower them that you can make it. You can c overcome your obstacles. The greatest thing I found for me was my growth pattern, can I tell you? Sure. Was my failures. Okay, mm. yeah, me too. And Good. my disappointments. Right. Because right. I used them, again, we're talking about faith to faith, mm -hmm. stepping stones right. to do better. Yes. Right. So I took those failures and I really, you know, I took them and I just ran with them. So there's something better. <laughs> you got to go in this other exactly. direction. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. right. That's what I did. That's so what it's goodness. always a win-win situation. Yes. And I always. say win always. because that is the name of one of your organizations, W-I-N, mm -hmm. win. And can you please share with us what yes. does that mean? Win, women, ignite it now. And the acronym that I use under the independent is fueling greatness. Mm. You know, like when you go to the gas station, you're filling up your car. I have to put yes. 93 in my car because of my car. But imagine filling women up with all those tools, budgeting. I, I learned it. how to go back. I teach budgeting. I teach finances. I believe in, listen, if you're going to be successful, be successful even in a financial mm -hmm. part. You don't mm -hmm. always have to struggle, but you can learn the tools of being a saver. I don't believe in debt. I believe in, you know, empowering women. Right. You can do this. So mm -hmm. Women Ignite It Now stands for that when we are winners no matter what. Yes, <laughs> especially <laughs> when we all work together. Yes, thank you. Exactly. Amazing. Very much for joining us. <laughs> thank you. Continued success. We thank want to keep so hearing much. about the stories of the thank people you. that you're empowering. Yes, and thank, thank you, you very, very much. And Shantae, as thank always, you, you always bring the most <laughs> engaging, <laughs> fantastic, empowering guests. Thank you. Stay tuned for more on Live It Up. We're helping you be a win for you.